Hey guys, that's going to be a quick guide on how to use uh, save states and how to practice on Bloodmoon for Hitler's plus speedruns, whatever you really want to. So let's load in into the game. I just made this, uh, made this character right here. And let's say that you want to practice, I don't know, backstabbing the wolf, right? But of, co but of course you would want to do it for boss fights and such. Let's see. I am right here, right? And there is a couple of ways to make a save file, but first, like, you want to quit out. I I'm not actually sure if you uh, need to quit out, but I like to quit out from the game first to make sure that my position is saved. And uh, let's go to main menu, quit from the game, and I go to settings, application save data management, and if you want to make a save state. You can do it in two ways. I have, uh, you can do it on both USB stick or you can do it in the cloud. But to do it in cloud, you have to have PS Plus, and also not only you have to pay for it, it's also slower, you know, because it depended on your internet connection. I prefer USB stick. The save files are really, uh, really small, like thirty megabytes for each. So if you want to make a save state, you click Save Data and System Storage and copy to USB storage device right here. You can see that you can upload to the, to the cloud, but you don't need to, obviously. You can choose either of the options. I choose stick. You choose what game do you want to uh, put to <coughs> put to your USB stick. Click on that, mark that, copy. Yes, over it. Copying. That's going to take a couple of seconds. And what are you, if you want to practice fast, and I'll get to it later, you want to click on save data on USB and just press PS button. Press PS button once, you're going to go back to this. And I'm going to explain why later. So right now we did the save state at the point right before the wolf. Right. We start the game. Obviously, it's PS4, so it's really slow as well. Ba, ba, ba. Play flying. Load game. As we can see, we have like this 155 save file. Remember that number, 155 in game time. So we spawn here. For example, you want to practice backstabbing this wall. Yes, and that's why you practice. You fail, right? You quit out again. Ma again, I'm not sure if you really need to. <clears throat> if you really need to quit out to the main menu. Not sure yet. And if you want to really quickly say, uh, load up your save file, you hold your PS button. Close application, OK, and you press PS button again. If you're going to press PS button in the main menu right now, it's going to take you to the last option that you were hovering over, right? So it's going to get you back. Save data on USB storage device with one click of PS button, just like that. And then you want to copy to system storage, which is the game. Copy. Yes. Go back. Again, press PS. Uh, PS. Uh, <clears throat> button and go back to the game. So this is the say like the sa fastest way to practice basically on PS4. It's re it's very tedious. Of course, it's not PC. We don't really have a safe organizer, but it's, it's the best we can do. And again, as we can see, it's again 155. You go into the game and the wolf is like still eating the corpse, right? <clears throat> and the thing is, every the how save state work on PS4 and in Blood One in particular, you can have ten characters in different places of the game, and it will count as one save file. So, for example, let's go out. So, for example, Jesus, that's so long. The old game, you can have. 10 different characters 
in different places of the game to practice particular things. And on top of that, if you have, if you want to have even more save files, more than 10, you can do something like that. Let's go to the screen at the moment. There's my OBS. I will quit from the game and PS4. And I'm plugging... I'm plugging the same USB stick to my... Uh, to my uh, computer. And we have this folder called PS4. In this folder, you have saved data. And it's very important. And of course, you have some random numbers. But the most important is to make sure that this folder with your save file is called PS4. Otherwise, PS4 will not read that. PS4 and save data. So basically, if you want to copy that, you can... Of course, it's in Polish. Copy that back to PC. Wait, I'm dumb. Sorry. Just move that. And it's right here. It's your save state with a wolf. And of course, you can delete that. And of course, there's going to be no save state. And you can make entire, like, I have save files, and I call them like that. BL4, Oba Snow Hit, No Hunter's Dream, No Hit, uh, you know, regular No Hit, Speed Run, Bass. If I want to have BL4, Oba Snow Hit Run save files on my USB stick, I just copy to the USB right here. Again. And inside it's called PS4. Wait, I fucked it up. Go back. Uh, let's, oh my god. Sorry, I'm PC inept. Save files, PS4. Wait, save files. And make sure it's called PS4. Make sure it has saved data. Make sure it has like random numbers afterwards. Either way, I plug my USB stick back to PS4. <sighs> Go back to PS4. Again, settings, application save data management, save data on the USB, copy. Copy that straight back. And when I'm going, uh, when I'm gonna go to the game, I should have uh, my BL4 save states right there. Play offline, load game. And when you see, I have every single my build for save file, whatever you're choosing. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I can, I could have two more. So that is how you switch between the save states. And uh, yeah, I think that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and see you, see you around. Bye.